Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Echo Papa, and today we're going to talk about virtual file folders. Uh, virtual file folders are these red folders right here. And first, real quick, we'll talk about what is a regular folder. A regular folder is just any directory that's on your hard drive that is storing music. Uh, here, I'll, I'll show you one. Let's go to my music directory. We'll go here. And we've got all these folders. And these folders here are full of mp3 files and these are physical directories on the hard drive uh, that you know store your music now what a virtual directory is is um, uh, like a directory that only exists inside the database uh, you won't find this directory anywhere on your hard drive except for as a, a, a little micro file that uh, shows uh, your the name of your directory and, and what songs are in it the the songs that are in here are the songs that you set up and you can put anything you want in here you can mix it from other directories genres it doesn't matter uh, it's completely up to you uh, so let's jump right in and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make one um, go right here where it says add virtual folder and we're gonna call it test folder we're gonna say okay and here we are, here's our new directory. You can see it's highlighted right now and there's nothing in it. It's completely empty because we haven't added anything to it. So let's go ahead and throw some stuff in there. We'll put some uh, let's put some disco in there. Go ahead and we're gonna take some songs, take it, we'll drag it right there. Oh, if you want to highlight a block of uh, music like this, you can just select any one you want, hold down the shift button, and then it will you'll uh, select that whole block. Uh, also if you want to just select individual songs you can select multiple songs by holding on the control button and that will also you can take the, those songs and drag them around. Alright but back to our, our virtual folder. Uh, here's our folder right here. Here's all the songs that we put into it. Now we can add other stuff and put into it. Let's add some, let's add some funk. Grab some random songs here. Take it into our folder and then there and you can still sort these uh, just like you would any other folder at X just like a regular folder um, you can take them take these files move them uh, into a playlist move them to a side list whatever you like uh, if you want to get rid of a song uh, just right mouse click on it and click remove from virtual folder now that song is gone from the virtual folder but it has not been deleted from your hard drive it's it's still there somewhere it's just no longer uh, in our folder let's go ahead and uh, we're going to rename this, we're going to call it 70s folder. Go ahead and move it. Now one thing you have to watch out for is uh, you can nest these files, uh, these folders, and that's where you can put one folder inside of another one. So if you have, uh, let's say, uh, like this one I have uh, this directory open right now if I were to select a new virtual folder it's not going to make a new uh, folder at the bottom what it's going to do is it's going to add another folder in here I mean you can take it and remove it if you want but it's, it's easier if you just don't already don't have one of these selected so uh, let's go ahead and uh, do that uh, on purpose right now we go select our, our 70s folder we're gonna go ahead and click here new folder and we're gonna put this uh, BG's Okay, now you see the Bee Gees folder is now inside of our 70s folder. And same way, we can populate it. Bee Gees. And select the songs that we like. Put it in there. Now it's in our folder. And you can set up these folders uh, if you want. Uh, like, let's say that there's a. Um, uh, in this case, you know, I have these star songs. These are songs that work at pretty well any event, you know, whether it be uh, with, with a really mixed crowd. So if you're like, say, at uh, a block party and you have, you know, old people, young people, you know, it's I've just made up a, a song list that's, that works for everything, weddings, you know, backyard barbecues. So, uh, but also if you're just doing a temporary folder, like, for example, I'll do one for just about every event that I do. So that way, when I'm done with it here, you can see delete virtual folder we say yes and actually we're deleting that little file that I was telling you about we say yes and that that is gone so I can set one up for let's say a wedding and put in you know your first dance songs and your song requests that you have and I'll put in multiple uh, files in inside of it 
uh, virtual folders inside of it, you know, one for requests, one for, you know, what's the cake song going to be, etc. And then when I'm done with it, I can just delete it, and then I no longer have to look at it in my, in my, in my browser. So, but that is virtual file folders, and uh, that's part one. Uh, if you feel you know everything about virtual file folders and you learned all you need to know, uh, you can go ahead and quick quit right here. But if you want to do some more, uh, in part two, we're just going to go ahead and we're going to build um, some uh, database of virtual file folders. And I'll show you some cool stuff that you can do with it. So uh, my name is Echo Papa. If you like this, make sure that you click like and uh, share it with your friends if you would. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in part two.